Well, it's a good morning to Wes Davidson from Wes Davidson Real Estate. How are you, Wes? Very well, Emma. Nice cold mornings, but beautiful days this week. It's been good. They've been very, very chilly. Now, I saw something on the news the other night. It was about how the population in Melbourne is declining. This has all got to do with yeah. people, especially during COVID, moving out to regional places and other parts. What's going on with the migration? Yeah, well, figures actually came out on realestate.com last week, I think it was, and uh, it's quite interesting to have a look at the winners and the losers. The biggest um, uh, gains were regional Queensland. A lot of people moved to regional Queensland. There was about 43,000 people moved there, under 20,000 into regional Victoria. Uh, the big losers were Sydney. They lost about 30,000 in terms of net migration, and Melbourne was also just under 30. So uh, the big cities getting on the nose, people were moving out. Uh, but then the big price winners, look at the price changes during COVID. And Perth was the, uh, the capital city and the best performing market for growth in uh, to overall. And then you group into regional Queensland came second and then regional Victoria came third. So regional Victoria has done very well out of the COVID crisis over the last 12 months in terms of property, as we have been saying, and as we have been seeing for so long now, it's not funny. Absolutely. The the new listings keep coming in and you've got three again this week. Tell us about them. Yeah, look, a good unit up, up in Stewart Street, unit four, number four. It's on the market at 220000 Got a long-term tenant. She's a very, very good tenant, so um, thoroughly recommend her. Uh, low maintenance property, ha does have a good size backyard. It's got a bit of space around it, which a lot of units lack, so it does have that. Yeah, it's a set and forget sort of investment for me. Um, has evaporative cooling, gas heating, single lock-up garage, and there's a pergola area at the back. That's unit four, number four, Stewart Street, on the market, 220000 We have a new listing coming up in uh, Finlayson Court down near the river. It's a three-bedroom brick veneer home. This is an ideal retirement place, Emma. You're just literally 100 metres from the river itself. You go for a walk, beautiful, quiet court, great part of town, and that's on the market at uh, 539500 We'll have the photos out for that sometime next week. And we also have a house coming up, and I'll be able to tell you more about it next week, in Horsham West for $240,000. Uh, it's a renovated delight, and I say that in the nicest possible way. No, it's not a dump. It's a house that just has been let age gracefully over the years, and it's got so much potential. It's got so much character. I really like it. Really big lounge room, formal dining area, office, if you like. It's a great home. I'll be telling you more about that next week, but that's in Horsham West, and that's um, $240,000. If you would like for the details or perhaps to get your name on the list for the uh, pre-inspections, give me a call on 53820000. And any other properties online at wdre.com.au. Wes, have a wonderful weekend. You too, Emma. See ya.